today, we're gonna get to see what Rod's face actually looks like. We've used age progression software to see what his face will scientifically look like, and it is awesome! Let's go! What's up, my dudes? How's it going today? Doc Blake here today. Welcome back to Ice Cream 3. We're about to have a fun time because um, we're going to be answering a question that has been on my mind ever since I have played Ice Cream. And the question is, what does Rod's face look like? I've been asking that question for so long and as I sit here under the couch in a very tiny state, uh, you know, trying to trying to live in this world, we're going to be answering that question. We're going to be taking the face of Rod and revealing it. I guess kind of. We're going to be trying to do a little bit of guessing. The idea is that I am going to kind of take the face of, uh, you know, young Rod and try to age it up to get to where we are today, I guess. So before we get started, make sure to leave a subscribe. We're going on to 700k, and you gotta get in the under 700k club. You know, you gotta be, you gotta be part of the the crew. Get in here, become part of the deck pack. But um, yeah. Before we start, we always have to start with Rudy the refrigerator. Again, my little sister has picked the <laughs> comment that apparently is gonna be on the refrigerator. I honestly have no idea what it is, but you know what? I'm starting to love it. I am starting to love these random comments. I have no idea what they mean. Like last <laughs> yesterday or two days ago was bees. It's just bees. Rudy is now just saying like <laughs> memes of just bees. So um, I wonder what he's gonna say today. So I like how well, like, this whole video is about finding out about Rod's face. We're gonna be pretty much like trying to like use science to like reveal his face and take off the mask and do all this stuff. But in the meantime, we're like talking to a refrigerator. So Rudy, what do you have to say to me today? <laughs> Bathroom. <laughs> what? Bathroom? <laughs> okay, um, again, I am confused. Rudy, you are not a bathroom. <laughs> you are a refrigerator. Stop saying that. Or actually, am I like ruining Rudy's dream? He's like, my one dream is to become a bathroom and you're you're just spitting on my dreams. Rudy, I'm sorry. I, I didn't know. I, I, you know what? You are, you are a bathroom. I am... I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, okay, Rudy. Um, great comment, by the way. Bathroom. Okay. Um, sure. <laughs> uh, so I guess let's just get started. The whole concept is getting his face revealed. So um, I guess I wanted to show you something that I've been wondering myself. So, um, as you can see, I am flying around using the Outwit mod. Make sure to check him out in the description because Outwit does so much work. He is, he's doing amazing things and, uh, he is, like, just an incredible genius with working with these mods. And, um, I've always asked the question of my, like, myself, like, what does Rod's face look like? And I remember in one of the videos, I literally went into Rod's mask and you could see... There's nothing. We have nothing to work on because his whole head is empty. His whole face is empty. He could have a sweaty head under there, but it's invisible. He puts on the mask, his head is invisible now. So the only thing we have to work on is if we go into this NPC menu, we can spawn Rod Jr. And this is the Rod from the cutscene. So if you see, this is the face that we have to work with. Is as incredibly like creepy it is, his eyes are kind of just staring into your soul, right? Like look at him, he's just like, Hey, I'm Rod, right? So, um, what I'm thinking is that we take a picture of this face. We take it and we put it into like an age progression software just to see what computers will think that he looks like. Okay, so I'm on changemyface.com. Apparently it's aging software, so I'm gonna try the demo and uh, I'm gonna upload the picture of Rod's face and see what happens. We're gonna see before our very eyes what Rod would look like when he's older. I actually don't know if this is a good website to do it. We, we can actually do it with FaceApp, right? I mean, we've done things with FaceApp before, so we can actually probably manipulate it to a better degree, but let's just see what this, oh, oh geez. Okay, well, I don't think that Rod looks this old, but apparently this is what Grandpa Rod would look like. Look at how sad he looks. Oh my gosh. Oh man. So yeah, apparently you can go through and see what somebody looks like if they did smoking, drinking, or tanning, apparently, according to Change My Face. And uh, it looks very different. All of them look just very sad though. I don't think that this is what he would look like. In fact, we do know the exact age of what he is in Ice Cream 2 and 3. If we go back here, you can 
see that his face is only like 14. He's 14 like right now. He gets the letters in the mail um, in Ice Cream 3 that kind of reveal his age. He gets the last letter and I think 1965 or something like that. 1965 and he's like 25 or something like that. I remember I looked at the picture and I did the math. Okay, so I just went into the game files. Apparently this is every single card that was ever sent to Rod. And so this, it says the last one was in 1965 on his 25th birthday. Um, we know that Ice Cream 3 takes place in 1984, I think? It was 1984 or 1983, I remember from their video, right? So, in 1965, if he was 25, that means that 19 years has passed between 1984 and 1965, right? Plus the 25... Welcome to Dak Blake Math. Why are we doing math right now? He is 44. So that means he's not gonna look old. He's gonna look kind of like middle-aged. Okay, so here we are. We have the face and we are in face app. This is the app that I feel like is so good at like aging people up. Watch, we can even give him a smile. Look, that is so creepy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That is the creepiest thing I've ever seen in my life. Okay, um, Rod, uh, please stop smile. Okay, now that even, that's even more creepy. Now he just looks angry at me. Put the smile back. No, 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 let's put no smile. Ah, I don't even know. Okay, but um, I think we need to give him like a beard, right? What would he look like? Oh, you know, honestly, already he looks so much older. Um, but I think we have to age him up first and I think we can do that. There is an age button. So this is what he looks like originally and he's young. So if we click young, does it make him younger? It does, oh my gosh. Um, oh, that just looks weird. Okay, so let's just see old. Ooh, okay. You know what? That doesn't look too old, right? What does cool old look like? Oh, that's way too old. Okay, let's go to cool. Let's go to old, which is like, he doesn't look like he's a grandpa yet, but he looks kind of older. Actually, we can also make him look a little bit younger than he is right now by giving him that beard back. And you know what? He's starting to look that. He's starting to look like he's supposed to look. Okay, wait, what if we give him like some glasses? Can we do that? Oh, we can. Okay, what does he look like? Oh my gosh. So I can already visualize this so far. So this is our before picture, right? This is what he looks like. You know, it's very smooth. He's got his rosy cheeks, giant eyes, by the way. And then we have this, which is much different. I mean, take away his whole like body because it kind of still looks like he's the kid form because he's not tall. He's actually, if we put this head on Rod's body, what would it look like? All right, so I've spent the last like five, 10 minutes actually putting the head on his face. And so you've already seen what the face looks like, but you haven't seen what it looks like on Rod's body. So I put a little question mark with a little box over the top because we're gonna finally see what Rod looks like. So if I take it and I take it and I, I move it to the side, you can kind of see a little bit. You can see a little bit of the beard under there. And here's the reveal in three, two, one. Oh jeez, that looks so weird. What? So yeah, um, his neck doesn't really work right because I had to like cut out his face from um, the other pictures. But if we like actually look at what his face looks like under the mask, right? I think that's what it would look like. You see, this is what we normally see going around in our normal day to day is this ice cream mask smiling with this evil intent to kidnap and make people, I guess, consume this really poison ice cream? Under all of that is um, what we'd assume to be something, but in technicality, there's nothing. So we have to make this face pop up. And, and look at this thing. Look at how creepy this face is, right? Just imagine Rod's head just like that big. <laughs> but I think this is what his face would look like. And um, you know, he does have those like really long eyes and I know this is really creepy, but like technically he's supposed to have like a really smiley face and we can make his face like super smiley. So hopefully his face does not look like this because that is so creepy. I mean, look at that. I mean, compared to like the original head, like, oh geez, that is so creepy. Ah, put it back, put it back, put it back. You could be like, Rod, I have something for you. <laughs> Rod, I just found $5. Do you want it? <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh man. <laughs> hey, Rod, do you want some ice cream? <laughs> oh man. Oh man. I, 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 <laughs> I have too much fun making this. Rod, you know I have your blender, right? 
Do you want your blender back? <laughs> oh, okay, I need to stop. I need to stop. Okay. Uh, oh, wait. He looks mad now that I'm stopping. Oh, man. But that that's Rod's face. Jeez. I kind of want to keep messing with his face. I mean, this is too much fun. We can give him, like, a face that is just, like... <laughs> He's just happy. We can give him a, like a mad face. Like, oh, jeez, that is not working. His glasses. No, they're not. This is not right. We could be like, Rod, I'm sorry to tell you this, but you're going to have to go to jail. <laughs> He's like, but why? Because, Rod, you kidnapped people. And <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Wait, we can make his eyes much bigger. Hold on. Right, don't you dare use those puppy dog eyes on me! That will never work! <laughs> he just snaps back. Why? Why won't that work? Because you're not gonna get out of this one, Rod. <laughs> I can't. Oh man. What if we just turn him into like an alien? We can just make his head super giant. I mean, it's already giant, but like we could just we can just do this. There you go. Now he's just mush. This is pure rod. We're just we're not even editing him. This is just what he looks like in the real game. Welcome to Ice Cream Four, right here. New <laughs> new rod. It kind of looks like if we just preview it and like do it, it looks like he explodes. Just <laughs> oh man, what am I doing right now? <laughs> just, out of nowhere, we're just like, we're like, this is what he looks like. And I'm like, hmm, what would it look like if we messed up his face? Can we do that? Mess up his face. <laughs> now he kind of just looks like a disappointed dad. I kind of gave him a little bit of like a... Come on, dude. But look, if you just give a little bit of a smirk. Oh, he's a little bit proud of you. Look at that. He, uh -uh. Oh, you did something good. There he goes. He's smiling again. Oh, no. You got an F on your report card. Oh, no. Now he's really sad. Oh, no. And now you stole his ice cream recipe. Oh. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, now we're in the real game. And now I can, all I can imagine is that face under the mask. And he's just like this. <laughs> He's just like scowling at us like, why are you running from me? So yeah, um, because there is a uh, young Rod in existence, we were able to age progression software his face up. Isn't that interesting? That is just like, that's pretty cool. But uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna leave the video here. I feel like we messed around to the extreme degree today. And I feel like that's the best way to have fun. So hopefully it made you smile and hopefully it was good enough for you to subscribe, right? Eh, eh, eh. Join the DAG pack going on to 700K. Get in the under 700K club. So thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed and you will enjoy the rest of the week. We're gonna be trying a lot of new stuff. So I'll see you in the next video. And as always, Peace out, my dudes!